Your Tesla arrived during the day. Fantastic. Here's the fob. I should probably go put on some pants. So I have some place to put the fob. Hello, my prince. You remember that I own you, right? I seem to remember that arrangement, sure. Well, all your money belongs to the Camarilla. And I don't mind a little extravagance here and there, but you went way over the line buying a Tesla. It seemed like a good investment at the time. That was a huge purchase that caught a lot of attention. What part of low profile don't you understand? Your access to the account has been suspended. I'm sending you $1,000 in PayPal. <clears throat> Thanks for the $1,000. That was a bit much of Ogodro. Even for you. I could have gotten a much more expensive car. A Bugatti would definitely fit me better than a Tesla. But the Tesla is more economical, and the Tesla is really fast. I'm meeting Angel, in the backyard, David. Rats. Yuck. Enjoy. We'll meet you at Alberto's, after. I don't have money. How will I get in? The money well, has run a little dry at the moment. I'll come up with a plan, and soon it won't be a problem. Nonsense, Avogadro. The door fee is only $10. I think you can manage that. Besides, you have a thousand dollars. Gift. I can cover your door fee. That's entirely fine. You let me crash with you last night. And that's worth at least... Twelve dollars. Don't forget the whipping I gave you in the cage, mister. Don't get snarky with me. And, thanks, for covering the door fee for me. Is the dead woman in Bessona one of Victoria's victims? Could she have been a sex offender? Hello Candy, you're on speakerphone. I hear they found a woman's body in Bessona, and it looked like Victoria's M.O. Well thank you. That's what I was aiming for. I'm doing the paperwork tonight and she will be identified as Gift Myers. Oh my god. They'll think I'm a sex offender. No, they won't. They'll just think you were dating a sex offender. Prince Sarah miraculously found a warm house. Isn't that kind of odd? Something weird is going on. Dormouse defies the usual conduits of information and place in time. It's fascinating to watch. Gift, are you one of those conspiracy theorists? <laughs> Look at, who, we, are. Who could come up with something more absurd, than the masquerade? We could lure Victoria with a sex offenders support group. Then we kill Victoria. And set the building on fire, killing a bunch of sex offenders. I put a lot of work into this club. I'm not for burning it down. I was kind of joking about the idea. Well, in our world, those things aren't jokes, they happen. <laughs>